hi everyone yeah it's your boy madaji oh i'm sorry since all these days for not posting the picture on how to verify your bvn your account with your bvn so right now i'm going to verify my sister account with a bvn but one thing i want to just do right now because some people doesn't have atm and some have been wasting money on the verification so right now i'm going to test firstly i'm going to input a bvn then test the payment with my own atm card just to know if maybe your son your daughter anybody your junior sister have bank account or doesn't have atm or doesn't have money on it maybe there is a way we can do that so right now i'm going to enter a bvn then after that i will I will use my HM so follow me on so right now I'm going to pause the video so after entering the BVN is going to top up to this page as you can see pay with card pay with bank pay with transfer pay with USSD I will just advise everybody kindly go with pay with card that is the only thing you can do right now if you pay with bank i don't know what is going to happen if you pay with transfer i think you are going to die a code or usd no i think usd after pay with card is usd but i will advise you to go for pay with card so let's move on then i click on pay with card so i'm now now i'm going to enter my own um atm details to pay for her so i have to pause the yo before going with that, so after you enter your bank details, your expiring day CVV at the back of your ATM, then that's when you are going to click on pay 200 naira. So that's what I'm going to do now, but I can't just leave my, I can't just like that, okay? As you can now see, I've already paid with card, then I'm going to click on authenticate. You click on authenticate. Then it's going to top up another browser pay start. so we are using paystack to pay as you can see we are using paystack and it's the safest payment method paystack is the oh wow Author authorization was abandoned please try again later okay let me try pay with another card i'm still going to use my card right now but just let us wait and be patient then i click on authenticate again Let's wait and see. I just want to see if I can use my card to pay for someone with that BVM verification or not. That's what I'm trying to do. So be patient. I think it's loading. Wow. Yeah, it's loading. Okay. It's loading. loading okay let me pause so right now they are going to send an otp to my phone number to confirm the payment for those who are that are um that are familiarized with um payment of using atm card to pay so you can see they're going to send an otp to my phone and i'm going to copy the, uh, the otp so let's wait for the otp So right now i'm going to paste my otp then submit click on submit so with this they are going to deduct sooner from my hands as you can now see it's very oh, sorry i've already paused the video it's um it's wrote payment successful and immediately it goes back to ink nation wallet so we are going to wait patiently for it to load and check okay you now see they just ask the question do you want to be an exchanger then i click no because she doesn't want to be an exchanger yeah so what next you can see the account you can see that verified so our account is already verified i use my atm to pay for her but i integrate a bvn inside the system so that's all as you can see thank you very much Yo, god bless you you are end user verification successful can you see now the verification was successful 
thank you very much for the video so with these i think you can haul verify your account but please do not become an end you uh, an exchanger if you don't know what exchanger is all about some people are just clicking on exchange 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 well that's your cup of tea you have become an exchanger so that's everything thank you very much for it for video